Now at 4.30, a racially heated argument between a retired LAPD homicide detective and a black man has led to the review of hundreds of cases now handled by that former detective. That argument erupted after a traffic accident involving both men. But the fallout goes far beyond an exchange of insurance cards. KKL Lancer Mel Aragawi has details. What appears to be a car accident between a retired LAPD detective and a young black man turns into this heated confrontation in the Santa Clarita Valley that now has a district attorney's office involved. For any of you that have seen the video, it's horrific, right? Because it really illustrates, uh, you know, incredibly racist attitudes by this individual. In the Saturday incident caught on video and posted on social media Tuesday, the retired detective who LAPD confirmed as John Motto appears to be yelling racial slurs, including this. Go back in your little cage. The work record of Motto, who LAPD says retired from their Operation Central Bureau homicide last May, is now under review by the DA's office. The office says they have begun reviewing more than 300 cases, many of them homicide cases that Motto was involved in during his 33 years with the department. Under the law, we are required, once we become aware of someone having uh, racist tendencies, as, as in the case of this individual, we have to notify the defense lawyers in all the cases that this individual may have been a witness or participated in the investigation. Civil rights attorney DeWitt Lacey says these are some of the major red flags the investigation may look into. They're going to question whether or not evidence was planted. They're going to question whether or not uh, he ignored uh, evidence uh, from people of color, uh, black folks in particular. They're going to question uh, the type of uh, people that uh, he went after. The LAPD says as a former employee, Motto is not subject to disciplinary action, but they are working with the DA's office to review the cases. Are you going to take your ID out? The DA's office says it's beginning its review with pending cases and then it'll work its way backwards. We tried to reach out to Motto through phone numbers and an address listed for him, but did not hear back. In Valencia, Hermela Aragawi, KCAL 9 News.